Last December, you were here and uh, yes. you were young, free and single. You're still young, but... I'm reading in the paper, Marriage and Babies, oh, all the cards. Oh. <laughs> well, the poor man, I've only been with him for six months. <laughs> so he's probably... Oh, look at him. And, oh. No, do you know what's so funny? He looks like Lumiere. In, so, in the jungle, <laughs> I said how much I fancy the candle from Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> and now, everyone, every time I put a picture up of, of Rob and I, people are like, oh, he looks exactly like Lumia. <laughs> He's my Lumia. My love. So, where did you meet? Well, it's quite a funny story, really. I, we met at the Brits and we met at Jack Whitehall's after party. Um, That's so fantastic. I, it's, it's, yeah. I mean, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it just sounds like a made up thing. Um, and, but I don't remember meeting him because I was so drunk. Oh, no. Oh. It was like, apparently, it was two in the morning. Apparently, I, <laughs> apparently I went over to him. I get him to tell me the story because I don't really remember. I went over and went, hello, who are you? <laughs> Lumia. Yeah. Lumia. He went, who are you? <laughs> and he got me a drink and then, yeah, and then we've literally been together ever since, oh, really. Oh, lovely. Just, yeah, we just. Yeah, I think like, anyone who st stays around after they've seen you fully drunk is the, <laughs> yeah. is the keeper. Yeah. yeah, and the next yeah. morning. Not yeah. that I don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Emily! No I, no, I stayed with him that night, but he was the perfect gentleman and he actually kind of put me to bed Even and just better. sat beside Aww. me. Aww. He's a keeper. Yeah, definitely, very nice. Definitely. And so I woke you... up the next morning, he saw me, what I looked like. Warts and all, so, <laughs> yes, keep her. So you're the perfect person to be presenting Single Town, then, because, well, you know, I, this I, is method presenting. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think because I, I'm i very open about the fact that, you know, I've, I've, I've sort of dated all kinds of people and um, I've enjoyed dating and everything, um, and I, I just kind of know... I know people and I know... I just know about dating mm. and I'm, I'm that person. I can't take my own advice, but I'm actually quite good at giving advice. So, oh. so explain the mm. show. How does so, it work? There are five couples um, and they're in that kind of limbo period of their relationship. They have an opportunity to go to Singletown where they can date other people. They're split up. They can date other people and at the end of each week they can decide whether they want to stick or twist. So it's a oh, bit it's like Temptation Island. Wow. Well, I've heard about this Temptation yeah. Island and people are liking it to that. It sounds really brutal, OK? And it sounds, you know, there's a lot of people asking me, yeah, but oh, that's a bit harsh, you know, do you not think that's a bit, a bit brutal? But the lovely thing about it, you find, you see all, see actually that a lot of the programme isn't actually about the relationships with each other and with other people and just, you know, getting off with someone else. It's about the relationship they find with themselves. Like yeah. some of the girls yeah. in there, they go in really kind of with no confidence and they've been relying on this boy yeah. for, mm -hmm. since they were teenagers. Yeah. Um, and then they, they, sudden, they all of a sudden start dating these guys that are telling them they're beautiful and they're wonderful and they what, really find themselves. But then what happens when they get back together? Do, what if one of them actually wants to go off and be single and one of them wants to keep the then relationship? Then they both have to stay. Yeah. Well, I mean, you don't have to, they're not chained <laughs> to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The rules are, if, if, you, if one of them, so they, have, they each have, um, there's two boxes on this podium. It's all very hosty at this yes. point. Um, and, you know, Joel and I say, right, you have to check which box is which. In one of the boxes, there's a love heart and the other one's empty. And if Ooh. they choose the box with the love heart in it, they show it at the same time. And if there's the love heart in there, they... Uh, if there's both a uh, love heart in both boxes, they stay together and they, they've realised, you know, the grass isn't greener, yeah. we want to be together. Yeah. Or if one or both of the boxes are empty, they both have to return to single town and carry on the rest of the And of course, these people they've tonight, chosen to do this show yeah. as well. So yeah, obviously, completely. there is yeah. something yeah. about their relationship That's not that they're yeah. 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 answers. I, I think as young people, it's 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 easy to do that. I know that thing of when you're you don't know anything else. You've just yeah. been sort of in this thing since you were so young, and it's kind of all you know. I said, do you relate to that? You know, you're saying yeah. about the girls, their confidence being wrapped up yes. with the relationship does somebody like yeah it? i think yeah. well there's, there's this thing isn't there as as women if we're just talking you know very kind of um black and white as as women we do i mean again i'm kind of talking for myself but i've always in the past relied on that um security of being with somebody i i, I always in the past used to feel i needed a man's approval to tell me that i'm it's beautiful funny, isn't and it? this and that. how yeah. often you can ask a woman okay so have you ever chosen somebody that you liked and mm. so often Women will say, no, well, actually, now you've come to mention it, I only go with people that like me. Yeah. We have to be liked first. Yeah, yeah, completely. And that is exactly the sort of journey that, you know, I experienced in the jungle, you know, finding who I was as a person, mm. getting to know myself as a person. And what better way to do that than to literally be stripped bare of everything, mm. you know, your, the mm. things that you use as your armour, like your makeup and your mm. tan and mm. um, your social media posts of looking... You know, yeah. like <laughs> breathing in and like slimming your pictures down and things. And you, you know, don't do any of that. No? I don't, I don't, don't do any 
no, app stuff. I so don't. So very quickly, because we're running out of time. So yeah. the marriage and baby things, you kind of dodged that. You oh. Sort of went, oh, isn't he lovely? And we went off on a side you know, so <laughs> Marriage and babies to me is, is something I really want to do. It's definitely not what everyone wants to do, but I definitely want to do that. And, you know, it, Rob and I, it is still early days. We're, it's so easy to fall in love so quickly and be like, oh, let's just do it all now. But uh, And, you know, my, my body clock is naturally saying... It's kind of flirting with the idea. It does, yeah. you know, and I think... I look at Holly Willoughby and I go, oh, that's what I want. Well, you know, don't we all? Yeah. And, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she's Join got the, the, the gorgeous kids. <laughs> and, yeah, she's like, for now. Oh. Yeah, it, and, I, and, yeah. and for now, you know, it's work and um, I, I, love, I love being free, mm -hmm. you know, I've got my friends, family. Well, listen, and... sadly, we are out of time, but yeah. when there is a big announcement, you know which show you're coming on for. Oh, yeah. Yeah. definitely. Emily, oh. take yeah. everyone. Thank you.